Scarlet Braces. Notice it's balancing the people of Ireland and Nobelk is the ways of the Irish leprechaun. The bit tells that the leprechauns make all the shoes and put the fairies wear. The bit tells that every leprechaun has a pot of coal hidden away in a secret place. And the bit tell you if you see a leprechaun, never to take your eyes off him, although he disappear before you look back again. That was why even Pat Fitzpatrick went out about each day, he was always saying to himself, if I ever see a leprechaun, I won't take my eyes off him till he gives me a pot of gold. Pat might be a better boy at his pond my dick potatoes, and less time looking for leprechauns at a pot of gold. Still, all this church in the door. One fine day, Pat got set of a little man, not be his own man. He's sitting on a toast to sew a pair of fairy boots. Pat bit his lip and stood very still. I won't take my ass off him, so I won't. Not to his mean the richest boy in our island. Quietly, Pat crept through the grass until he was close enough to reach out and grab the leprechaun in his fist. Got you! Now, where's your pot of gold? Oh, what you afraid now, poor creature, half to death, cried the leprechaun, and his little heart pounded between the pet's fingers. What such you say about gold? I don't know of any gold, anything about the towel. Pet squeezed the leprechaun a little tired, never once slipping away. Don't give me of your nonsense, no, she, she said. I shan't let you go until you show me your pot of gold. The leprechaun Rise and struggle until he wriggled one hand free and got point of the pet's shoulder. Look, boy, and be quick, you're coming in the corn. But where are you? He turned his head to look. But just in the nick of time, he saw it was a trick. You'll have to do better than that, he laughed, shaking the leprechaun. I'm not taking my eyes off you till I have your pot of gold safe in my hands. Then the leprechaun burst into beautiful tears. <gasps> You're a cruel, heartless boy, so you are a name. One can see that you are here, you are talking of gold, with your own house burning down and your mother inside it. What? In his horror, pet. Where in your job the leprechaun ran home just in the nick of time, he saw it was a trick and shook the leprechaun until the boat. All right, all right, the leprechaun spluttered at last. All you will tell you the find of pot of gold. No, you won't. You will show me the very spot. And taking off the scarlet braces, he tied them to the leprechaun like a lead to a dog. The magical little cow led part of the hill. Thousands of women, thousands of people grew in every direction. He stopped whistling from thistle uh, and looked exactly like every other. Since you won't take your eyes, I'm unable to tell you a lie. My pot of gold buried below this particular thistle, but in thinking, you need a spade to dig it up. Oh, oh, I see your trick. Patriot squeezes the leprechaun until it is you sing. I never find this one thistle again among so many. So he untied the scarlet braces of the leprechaun and tied around the thistle instead to my crib and they pushed the leprechaun deep into his pocket. But the way moment he lost sight of him, the leprechaun changed into thin air and was gone. But didn't mind. He ran home as fast as his leg would carry him and fetched a spade. He, it was so heavy that he dragged behind all the way to the hill. Thought he could trick me. He panted crew of the crowd good of bad Fitzpatrick. 
Puffing the Mugovin, he stopped up the hill to mark its forehead, and there was a sight in front of him that made his jaw drop. A pair of scarlet braces dangled from every face on his side as far as the eye could see. Thousands upon thousands of carded braces. There was no more hope of recognizing the leprechaun thistle. They were finding more particular drop of water in the hall of the Irish Sea. So, if you have a chance to see a leprechaun and you don't mind to steal her bottle of gold, you better sharpen a little here and remember the story of Pat Fitzpatrick and his scarlet braces.